I wish this wasn't an emotional morning. <laughs> this resolution isn't about taking control or telling the governor what masks sh should or shouldn't do. Most of you know that I've sat on the local school board here um, in the community for two years. And since COVID has occurred, it's been the most torturous activity I've ever participated in. Um, on a regular basis, I, I learn about kids who have committed suicide or who are hospitalized and not for COVID. So for, I just want to address one thing before I get into this resolution, and it's to Dustin, to tell you that I really admire what you do and the, and the spaces that you go to do it. But unfortunately, I disagree with you on a fundamental level, and it's for one reason. Everybody has the choice to wear a mask. Nobody should be forced to wear a mask. You and all those that believe in it, I support you. Absolutely, I will stand on any firing line alongside you for people who want to tell you why you shouldn't do it. But if you believe in your soul that that's the right thing for you, then you should do it. But for those of us who believe we shouldn't, for various reasons, we shouldn't be forced to do it. I took a ton of notes throughout this. This is my first opportunity to really have a conversation with the community about what this looks like. This resolution isn't saying we will or we won't do something. We are simply asking the governor to let us do our jobs. And we're really good at it. And I am extremely passionate about my job. We have the best health authority in Oregon. I'd say that anywhere on any platform. Our people show up. We're boots on the ground. We work with the school districts. We work with the nurses. We're in those buildings. Contagions are constant in the life of humans. We have multiples of them that we deal with on a, on a daily, annual basis everywhere across the world. COVID is new, but it, this process isn't new to health departments. I, I asked for this resolution to come forward because I believe the governor is out of line. And this roller coaster that we have been on because she doesn't think that we know what's best is unacceptable. I firmly believe that myself and these two gentlemen to my left will work with every school district to make sure every kid is safe. There, I, I guarantee it. She needs to let us do our jobs. So this resolution, which I'm going to read, because we received a lot of testimony. I think Brenda had it bro broken out for me. Yeah, like 300 pieces of testimony and 95% of it is asking for this resolution to move forward and it's simply to say let us do our jobs let us have those conversations locally let us talk to our people our neighbors and our friends about what's best for us so before I move to ask you to approve this I'm gonna read it because lots of people didn't and it's important that you understand what we're asking the governor to do this matter came before the Marion County Board of Commissioners at its regularly scheduled public meeting on August 11, 2021. Whereas on March 8, 2020, Governor Brown issued a declaration of emergency in response to the COVID-19 pandemic, and since then has issued 23 emergency directives. And whereas beginning in the winter of 2021, Marion County as the local public health authority oversaw the administration of COVID-19 vaccinations throughout the county. And whereas to date, approximately 70% of Oregon residents have received at least one dose of the COVID-19 vaccine. Whereas on June 30th, 2021, Governor Brown rescinded state mask mandates and lifted all COVID-19 restrictions in Oregon, stating that going forward, response to COVID-19 would be delegated to local control. And whereas, Despite this, on July 30th, 2021, Governor Brown directed the Oregon Health Authority and the Oregon Department of Education to promulgate rules regarding all Oregon children attending schools grade K-12 to wear masks indoors while at school during the 2021-2022 school year. Sorry. Whereas, Marion County as the local public health authority has worked diligently along with its residents and community partners to significantly reduce the number of COVID-19 cases in Marion County, as well as provide vaccinations to people throughout the state. And whereas all jurisdictions are different and have different needs and local school districts have the best knowledge and ability to determine safety requirements for their students. 
And whereas the governor's recent order mandating all Oregon children wear masks indoors at schools ignores the specialized knowledge of local jurisdictions as to the need of their residents. Now, therefore, it is resolved that the Marion County Board of Commissioners request Governor Brown reconsider her directive mandating all Oregon school children wear masks at schools during the 21-22 school year. And it is further resolved that no county assistance or resources shall be expended in the enforcement of this mandate. And it is further resolved that the Marion County Board of Commissioners asks Marion County residents to continue to follow COVID-19 mitigation best practices and measures in order to remain self-governing and to commit to protecting our well-being and that of our neighbors. Dated at Salem, Oregon, this 11th day of August, 2021. So, Mr. Chair, I move to approve this resolution. I second the motion, but I'd also like to make some comments. Absolutely. We have a motion and a second.